Alright, so I'm back. And the thing is, I must check uh, how much values I had here. So this means this must will carry, must will it will insert into image uh, inside this database into image table values 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 values. So it will be, it must be, the count must be matched as the database we, we made it before. So I'm just check the structure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, it matches. The images and z card. All right, z card. Just let let just check uh, what's happening uh, after I click refresh. All right, so we have everything set. I believe we will have, uh, after I push the refresh button, I believe there are records already on my database. Alright, there is one empty record which I just clicked refresh, so the insert function f works. But, I want only to insert it, uh, only after the, only after the F9. Oh no no no, uh, because I still need to add title and description, uh, but I only want to insert the picture if there are any records. So, if is oh, let's do it like this. If there is a small picture, and then if there is a medium picture, and the names are upside down only. Only if there is some picture, then only insert the record. And then let's let's put these links together. So uh, one, two, three. F the fourth is small picture. Let me just small picture is this one. Fourth one, two, three, four. Then there's the medium size picture, and the names are only different. And then there is the original size picture. So let's see what hap what happens when I click refresh. Let's check the database. Alrighty, we have something. Uh, yeah, it it shows the picture names, but it doesn't show the link because I posted in the wrong pictures. Small picture medium picture original image picture whatever refresh check the database it has the links check whether the links are working great excellent spectacular so we have the pictures in our database and uh, great so I will delete all these records out yes so you have only pictures inside them and uh, now I must think of how to uh, change the title and description and also I must uh, because I will make six the same same web pages, I must make the page name, so it does include the page name. Mm. <laughs> so the page page HTTP is here. Um, the page name we should add here. I will just page name two. I will just make page name two equals. Alright, so this is where I inserted the pictures. I know, just deleted, so it's um, just a domain name. Alright, uh, now I must uh, change the title and the, and the description of the picture. So we now have the image here. Uh, we now we now have the image here. Yes, uh, but I must upload it. Uh, I mean, I mean, I must change the title and description. Uh, all right, don't need this. 
because that's a picture that's showing. I don't need it. It, it, it just runs blank. I mean, this is this field. All right. So I don't need. And uh, now I need to change the. Uh, uh, change the title and description. So uh, now I must take the small image so so source. All right, let's do it like this. Div line center image source. Build. Yeah, this is the picture which is showing. Uh, add picture PHP and this is the same file. Uh, title is with the name title. Description is this, and we need an hidden. Hidden input input type in it. So this means it's not available. It's not visible for anyone. Name in it. Ing. Let's do it like image small and uh, value in it. Value equals. I mean. So small image small image. So what it does, it will forward the same information. This information which will be inputted to the same page. And uh, all right, so I must get the post uh, name add images image this image title add. So let's do it like this. On the top here, add picture if post. Add the if if the add picture has been pressed, then do this. Else, if the picture was not pressed, do do this. And if the picture was not pressed, I will just close all this down because I don't want it to show. And uh, let's just echo out echo picture has been has been added although it has been added before and the break line go back go back uh, I will add this in a, in a link uh, add pick PHP so what does it mean uh, if a submit button has been pressed so if I changed the uh, if I change the values, the title and description, it gets to a new page. It gets to the same page, but it doesn't show anymore the submit codes. And it says, picture has been added, go back and click on the back button, which will lead back to this page. And here, if we have no uh, submit button press it, it will show the uh, add picture script. So, all right, so this will be more complicated. So it doesn't show anything, but once I press this button, it will show a blank page and we are connected. Your picture has been added because we have not updated and changed the fetch file. All right, so we go back and we go back to this page and we can up upload a different picture. I mean, some some kind of tattoos, don't know what it is. Upload it and, and it has, and when we change it, we go back and we have more pictures added now. Let's just check our database. Yes, we have many pictures of it now all right so uh, that's good now uh, when we click on the next I just center them out uh, we need to update the picture I just select the database you need to select the database always because it will not do anything with my skill check the time all right this tutorial will end and next tutorial I will be showing you how to update the title now, of course there are much similar simple ways to do it but uh, in my case I will do it like this all right so see you on the next part